I'll squirt it on. Try it. Is it yummy? Mm. Yep. Keep going. Remember, focus on the focus on the pot. Mm -hmm. It's awesome milking mm -hmm. out here with you all. Come on, James. James. Here, James. Yep. Try this James. back one. Try this one, James. Try that one. You're almost doing it. Here. Squeeze. About, you got to squeeze more on the top first. No. How about I do? No, James. How about you go on the other side with Daddy, and then he can teach you more. I love it. Bye, so we're just out here milking, milking our our nice Elsie here. Dad, I'm gonna. Here you go. You ready? My here, you squeeze at the top, and you see how this kind of gets full. Yeah, you just squeeze at the top with your pointer finger and thumb, and then squeeze down. Yep, so squeeze up here first. But these are kind of drained already. i try this one. Squeeze up here, and then point it out. Oh, she's about to push that grain bucket off the... Alice, can you help her? It's not about how hard you squeeze, buddy. You gotta squeeze to the top. Yeah, just like that. It's Keep about, doing it. It's about squeezing, squeezing at the top. The okay, don't don't pull down real hard. It's about getting in. It just in squeeze. The that um, he was getting in the bucket, you know. Yeah, I know. I know. We'll strain it. We'll clean it. Don't you worry. But straight out of her teeth, oh. it, is, it isn't dirty. Good girl, Elsie. So, James, I... We got, we're done milking her. I hold her. Then we're right. going to take her for just a little walk around I hold the um, the paddock here. No. So, I hold her right here. Dad holds her right here. And She's having a great time. Here, how about Dad? She's just finishing up some of her it's snacks. Cool. Superstar biker, cruising around. Look at her go, standing up. A week ago, she was not doing any of this. So I finally found the uh, post driver. Man, my hair looks awesome. I was just wearing some headphones while I was pounding those things in. Anyway, so I've got a uh, fence built here. So that way, the only access, you see that? Yeah, the only access is through there. And I have closed it off. Remember how that far spot, you see, uh, I think that one is, see Winifred over there? That used to be where the cows um, were only there. Like they, that's just where they lived. Yeah, man, look at that big hole in my shirt. <laughs> Some people, <laughs> you know, it is what it is. Why wear a good, nice shirt out to do work and then put a hole in it? Why not wear a shirt that already has a hole in it to do work? That makes more sense to me. Um, anyway. Hey, Winifred, come here. Here we go. She's coming. She just wanted to say hi. Um, so, yeah, if you have a hole in your shirt and you're working, that's okay. Um, now, if you're working a desk job with a hole in your shirt and it's not a remote job and you have to go into the office, probably need to get a shirt without that kind of hole in it. But anyway, so I've got um, this entry right here. So that way the cows can go into that spot. I've moved, I'll show you. See that watering trough right there? I moved that there and I'm going to fill it up with the hose or with the pipe that I used to fill up the um, pig water. See the blue pipe right there? I can just take it, take it out of there. Now I could put some kind of a valve or something on the end of it, but I think that right now I'll just um, have somebody come out here and help me hold it so that we can fill that thing up. That way the cows can get water. Hopefully I can start milking um, Elsie in this area 
and then I'll separate her from her calf at night. Still don't know really exactly where to put him. I thought about, let me show you this. Let me just give you a quick little tour of the barn here. Okay, this is the main, I don't know, they probably kept cows or something in here. This is where, you've seen this several times, this is where we keep the pigs. Um, here's just a little administration, whoops. That's just a little administration type of a spot. This is our storage stall. See the little bikes back there? We've got some rabbit hutches, a big mountain of bags. Um, this is where we kept our um, baby chicks. You'll notice that spot just right over there is where the brooder was. Um, this right here is where we mostly keep uh, Juliet. Um, the chickens have been in here scattering their food everywhere. I don't know. I mean, chickens like to get into things. This, speaking of chickens, this is where the chickens like to hang out and lay their eggs. Notice, we didn't collect eggs yesterday. There's one hanging out. That one down there, that one down there is a broody one, so we put a few eggs. We need to mark them. Here's some more um, nesting boxes that I'm going to put up. Here's where they roost at night. Their feeder, I can put a ton of food in there. And then their water, which I need to refill. This, if you notice from a previous video that was not leaking in a previous video, it's leaking now, so I need to replace that. I'm done with those little, they were cheaper. I just bought them on Amazon, and I don't like them. So I'm going to get one that's not a swivel joint. It's just one solid piece. Anyway, oh, and look. There's some coming right there in through that uh, little square. That's where that automatic, uh, automatic door is. So I'm not quite exactly sure. Oh, and then these stairs go to the upstairs. Super cool place. I'll give you that tour later. I'm not exactly sure where I want to keep Billy Bob, the uh, little bull. I'm kind of thinking in where we kept the uh, baby chicks initially. So we'll just see what happens. We'll just see what happens. Maybe I should um, call him to introduce. I was hoping that uh, Winifred would like that. This is like a super thorny, super nasty bush thing. And these pigs love to eat them. <laughs> I would think, what is the last thing that I'd want to eat? It'd be one of those, and they love it. Winifred, about ready to take a bath. Watch out. She just needs two more legs in and then she'll be there. Oh, she's not gonna do it. She's not gonna do it. I was just down kind of taking a knee and someone came up to me and greeted me and I thought it was a pig, but it was just Juliet. However, the pigs aren't too far behind. Look at how friendly. <laughs> Look at how friendly these pigs are. And this dog too. When was the last time your friend bit your ear? Or bit your face. <laughs>
Okay, now, I don't know if you can tell, but the cows are in the spot, which is great. They're already starting to like it. And they have not yet gone into the barn, at least now that I can see. We'll find out. <laughs> 